Please meet Daniel. He says he's a redneck who's ready to rumble. <laughs> Daniel, uh, what's going on? And I'm sorry about well, your pants. Well, Jerry, how you doing? <laughs> no, what's going on? I'm just an old hillbilly from Texas, you know. No. And, yeah. Yeah. And uh, I ain't never been married. I ain't got no kids. I own my own lawn mowing service, just me and my mower, man. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I don't. You've done more than cut the grass. <laughs> uh, I pretty much got everything I want except for the love of my life, you know. And, and uh, I said, have you ever had a serious relationship with a girl? No, a I haven't. No. No, I've just been going through them. So. That could be pretty painful. <laughs> Oh yeah, for the woman. Uh, so there you go. And uh, but you, now, th is there this woman you have your eye on? Oh yes, sir. Her name is Stephanie. She she lives in the same trailer park as I do. <laughs> okay, well at least you're well. You know, transportation's taken care of. Yeah. Uh, so what? So now what? Uh, tell me about her. Well, she's she's with this guy. She's about. Oh, she has a boyfriend. Yeah, she got a boyfriend. Oh. Supposedly. He ain't much of a man, though. Why do you say that? Uh, he's, he's about, I don't know, he's in his 20s. He ain't got no job. And all he does is sit around and watch NASCAR. He get, he get, they got kicked out of their trailer house, so she had to move in with her mo or his mother. And uh, I had to invite her, you know, to come over to my house to clean it because, you know, they didn't have no money or nothing. And uh, so we ended up having sex, and I think I fell in love with her, you know? Oh, oh. So let, I get the picture now. You all live in the same trailer park. She's got a boyfriend, but you hired her to clean your trailer, and while she's coming over to clean the trailer, you're, she's also cleaning you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. And how long has this been going on? About five months now. Five months, wow. Yeah. Well, does she say that she really cares about you? Yeah, she told me she loved me. Oh, she does? Well, then why is she still with him? I don't know. She tries to tell me sometimes she's confused, but, you know, she's all right, girl. So, you know, we, she runs around the trailer park a lot, you know. She's known around there for her cooking. She likes to cook deer meat and, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and catfish. I and, don't know if it's just the cooking she's known for. I don't either. Seems to clean a lot of trailers, too, huh? Apparently so. Yeah. She cleans mine well. But you're, you're the, you really like her. And do you think she can be faithful to you? Yeah, I think so. You know, because there are the guys in the trailer park. What if she's, you know, moved in with you all of a sudden when she's gone during the day? You'd think she was cleaning someone else's trailer. Well, it's something I'm going to have to work, work on, you know, to see what happens. Yeah, okay, but you really do like her. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now, this other guy, how well do you know her boyfriend? I've known him for about two years, I guess. Oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, obviously, you're competing for the same woman, but otherwise, is he a nice enough guy? Yeah, he's, he's all right. He's just pretty young and dumb. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you can't expect everyone to be as, as smart as you. Uh, yeah. Why, why, I tell you what, why don't we bring out uh, this fella, and his name is Justin. <laughs> Dirty old <laughs> Billy. You, you know I love her. her. I love her. You don't deserve her. You don't even have a job, man. All you that's, need that's because I'm, I'm at home trying to work my butt off, trying to, I'm scrapping, I'm collecting cans, yeah. just trying to help my family out, too. <laughs> Really? Yeah. How do you get them cans when you're sitting on the damn couch all day? I drink a lot of soda. I bet you do. Where do you get the money for that at? Selling plasma? Yep. Really? No wonder there's something wrong with you. You done got all the... Hey, rain out of your head! Go ahead. 
good. It looks looks like you're all excited. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, uh, did you have any? In fairness, did you have any idea that he was messing around with your girlfriend? I had a, I had a clue. <coughs> you had a clue, because she said she she would tell you she was going over to uh, clean his place, clean his trailer. Yes, sir. And when did you first start having suspicions that something else was going on? Uh, a few months go by, you know, and she's just been gone all the time. Well, let's take a break let's take a break and when we come back we're gonna meet her we'll be right back <laughs> this Stephanie basically is the uh, girlfriend of Justin and uh, but for the last you've been going with her for what a year or so yes sir and uh, but for the last five months she allegedly has been cleaning uh, Daniel's uh, trailer that you, you all live in the same trailer park but she's doing more than cleaning your trailer yeah and uh, she, you're saying she says that she loves you? Well, she told me. Yeah. I don't know, man. But she keeps going back to him. Yeah. Well, let's find out what she thinks about this. Here is Stephanie. Hello. Gary, I'm just so confused. Compare, compare these guys like cows and pigs. <laughs> I just don't know who I want. You, but you, you've been with Justin for a year. Now, is he well, closer to the cow or the pig? I'd say the cow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but uh, you've been going with him for a year, but is it true that you tell him that you're cleaning uh, Daniel's trailer here, but you're actually sleeping with him too? Why would you do that? Uh, he's just so young, and I just don't know. Just the past six months just have been so hard on us. Yeah. I just, we, I sit so around. So how are you going to choose which one? I sit around and try to figure out games. And today, I, I want to figure out who is the best redneck. Who's the, the best, best redneck? redneck for me? That is what I want. The best redneck for me. So well, I've you, you got your got sights set pretty together. high. <laughs> okay, so you've so that's going to be a contest now. They're going to be in games, redneck games. You call them. Mm -hmm. And uh, the first game today is uh, Bob for Pig's Feet. No way. Before, okay. Before you start, are before you start, are either of you Jewish? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna do bobbing for pig feet. Todd's gonna be the official timer. You have 30 seconds. Keep your hands behind your back. Let's go! Hey! Boy, what do you say, Pete? It looks like. Looks like we got one. Any? We got four on this side. We got a winner in this segment. Huh? <laughs> All right, stand okay. up. Stand up. Put your hands back on. Stand right. up. Come on over here. So, so Justin, so far you seem to be better in terms of going after a pig. Good right news for you, Stephanie. Uh, all right. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What's the next game, Stephanie? The second game is Redneck Horseshoe. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> 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 This is called redneck horseshoes. You each get one throw. We're gonna alternate. If there is no score or there's a tie score, we're gonna go into sudden death overtime. You each get three <laughs> throws. 
Yeah. There you Good. go. Okay, it's a, it's an hour show, so. Everybody, move up a step. Move up a step. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> One more. Come on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sudden death overtime. First one go. to make it wins. We're going to go at the same time. Ready? Throw. Throw. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Leave it there. Leave it there. Huh? So this is getting pretty exciting now, because as far as I can tell, these two, <laughs> these two guys are competing for you, and so far, uh, Daniel, you're, uh, Justin, you're better going after the pig, and uh, you're better in the toilet. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, so now, the love of your life has to win this third game, and what is this third game you've cooked up? The third game is tobacco spitting. I'm going to stand over here. I don't want to be a part of this. Hi, Pete, you want to explain how this is done? Both of you guys, come on over here. Oh, this is wrong. Take a chew, take a chew. Take a chew into the camera, let him see it. All right, line up right here. Whoever spits the farthest is going to be the tie-breaking champion winner. And you're going to get the love of this beautiful lady. Yeah. Yeah, aim, aim, yeah, aim that way. Don't, make sure you don't get the... Try not to get any on the audience. Tell me when you guys are ready. You got a nice big You'll one know. In there. <laughs> ready, Jerry? Yes, I, I'm certainly ready. All right, we're going to go on three, and then we're going to spit. Ready? One, two, three. three. Who won? Ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner! We'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing. Take care of yourself and each other.